A gas leak forces an evacuation of Gamble Rogers Middle School in St. Augustine. The fire department and a gas company were able to locate the leak and stop it. Channel 4's Crystal Moyer has more from nearby Pedro Menendez High School, where the evacuated students and employees spent the day. No injuries were involved in that gas leak. They've actually spent all day ventilating that school using fans and opening all the windows and doors. I spoke to a parent who said he noticed something was different when he dropped off his son. We usually drop off behind the back side of the school. We, we smelt it. I, I smelt a little bit of gas. I was like, that's kind of weird. Michael really Traden says he thought the smell was a result of some renovations they may have been working on. Kind of seen them the uh, last couple weeks. I've been putting some lighting in, some different things around there. Around 8 a.m., a staff member also smelled the fumes and called St. John's County Fire Rescue. Firefighters, hazmat crews, and a technician from Suburban Propane found a gas leak from a liquid propane tank near the boiler room. More than 800 students and staff members were bused to Pedro Menendez High School. Moving students is never the easiest thing in the world, but um, you know these two schools have really come together and done a great job. And they have buddy school plans within their operations, so there's a setup at the buddy school where they're going to house kids, where we're going to put kids. Transportation steps up and gets in line. After receiving a robocall about the evacuation, many parents picked up their kids early and say they were happy about the way things were handled. Really helpful. All the police department, local police department, were, were, uh, came and asked them a couple questions. They told me where to be, what what it was going to happen, what was going down. So yeah, I was I was very happy with it, very pleased. A spokesperson with the St. John's County School District tells me Gamble Rogers Middle School has been cleared for the day, and they are letting students back in for their regular school day tomorrow. For today, they kept all the students here at Pedro Mendez High School just for precautionary measures, and they had regular dismissal. Reporting in St. Augustine, Crystal Moyer, Channel 4, the local station.